Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Pokemon Omega Ruby Randomizer Nuzlocke episode 20 today. We are, we have to stop. Let's stop this Groudon. Let's stop the Groudon and hope that it's a cool legendary and not a crappy one. We need to get a Suitopolis. I don't, even, I don't even remember which one of these routes I've had encounters on or not. I have, wait a minute, I gotta go down, don't I? How do I get, do I gotta, di I don't dive here because that ended. Uh, let's see here. Where do I dive at? Do I go up left here? Because I'm pretty sure you go, you get to Sutopolis from the bottom, right? But it's not looking like it is. All these rocks are here stopping me. Definitely not this way. Definitely, we're definitely going the wrong way here. Do I dive in here? I know you got to dive to get to Sutopolis. How do I get to Sutopolis, though? There we go. Um, we're here. How do I get? How do I get to Sutopolis? Sutopolis. Looking for a cave entrance. What the heck? There's scuba divers down here. Does this guy battle? I don't want to battle you. Is that guy just? Are we gonna do an underwater battle? What if I use margin? I just use discharge. Do we all electrocute? I don't want to battle you, but are you telling me how to get Moss Deep is that way? Wait, you shouldn't battle me, right? Wait, you do battle even while Groudon is trying to end the world. I was kind of hoping that if I went and talked to that guy, he'd be like, hey, man, Groudon's trying to totally end this all, isn't he? But this Gyarados does not care about anything. Well, Gyarados, not cool of you, dude. Yeah, the weather's extremely harsh. Because there's a freaking grout on ruining the world, and this guy just wants to battle. We're not here to battle you, get Dude, that's all the damage that I did? Color change. Oh, good. That actually works for me. You tried to use Rain Dance against Groudon? My dude. Not Leave it to a Gyarados to try to use Rain Dance on a... Oh my goodness. Leave it to Gyarados to try to use Rain Dance on a Groudon. Not gonna work, dude. Groudon controls the city. Okay. I just gotta figure out how to get to Sutopolis. Yvettel. Oh my goodness. You have a Gyarados and a Yvettel? What's up, Yvettel? Is Yvettel, I'm assuming, a dragon type? I have no idea what type it is. I'm just gonna assume it's a dragon type. And that I can just be super effective here. Nope. Oh, you just used Disable? You punk. What typing are you? Are you a dark type? That'd be scary if you're a dark type. No idea what a Yvettel is. Oh, yeah. I think it is a dark type because I just used a second move and said no if I You're definitely a dark type. You're, you're definitely a dark type. Let's uh let's let's uh head on out of here, shall we? Are you flying type too? So I shouldn't pro probably shouldn't go into the blaze again. Let's go in with, with Zane. Oh crap, but I can't use Sir. Oh I have Earthquake. Oh wait, I probably can't use Earthquake because you're probably flying type. What am I supposed to do against this Yvettel right now? I guess I'm just going to use Surf. Anyway. That should do nothing. That did a little bit more than I wanted it to. And you lowered my special attack. I'm going to switch out again, dude. Let's switch out to Margin. If you're a Flying type, I'm just going to discharge you. This has been a pain. A pain. So far. Not as much of a pain, though, as freaking Edgar was when I was trying to record my podcast. The Takeoff Podcast. If you guys didn't know about the Takeoff Podcast, you can find it linked in the description below. What what did he just do? He just gave himself some health through my life? You took my life? Dude, this Yvettel is so annoying. Are you kidding me? And my special attack. Does Snarl 100% of the time lower my special attack? Please paralyze. He's using Snarl again. Are you going to lower my special attack again? Don't crit me. That would have been really annoying. Oh, wait. There's, there's Edgar being annoying, just like he was during the podcast. He's like, oh, hey, Dad, was I being annoying? Let me be more annoying to you. There we go. We got the Yvettel out of there. All right. That was rather annoying. Definitely going to have to potion up here. Edgar, please, just go lay down, dude. You can't You can't just keep power split. I don't know if I want a move power split. What is this? The user employs its psychic power to average the attack and special attack. With oh, nah. Let's get rid of power split. Hey, go lay down. 
Please, you can't be annoying again. You were already annoying for the whole podcast. Now you're going to be annoying in this? No. No. He's like, okay, you're right, Dad. I'm out of here. I'll just lay down like a good boy. Edgar, I've already taken you on a long walk. You did your business. We're here for a good day, not a bad day, okay? Let's potion up since this freak, through the mist of the world ending, just wanted to have a Pokemon battle. He just wanted to show off that he had a freaking Yvettel is all it was. I think I have all these hypers. There we go. All right. Where do I go? I don't want to go to Moss Deep. How do I get to Sutopolis? How do I get here? Do I got to go from the top, maybe? Oh, come on. Because I already... Oh, wait, do I have to get to Sutopolis from, like, the left? I have to go to the very bottom left of the map? Is that, like, a thing I have to do? I kind of feel like that's a thing I have to do. Yes, please use another repellent. Let's just try this first before we do that. Let's see if I can just get there this way. But I wonder if... That would be so annoying if it made me go literally all the way around the, the map to do that, though. I don't want to battle you. Oh, here we go. I think we're coming up on it. Here we go. I think I think we might have... I think we might be in Sutopolis range right here. Oh, yeah. Here we are. Gotta go down. Ooh, don't battle. I don't want to battle any of these trainers who are willing to battle, even though Groudon's about to end the whole world. You know really cool if you could, like, walk around here? You could, li like, literally run into Groudon. Like, you could just see him just marching around. Okay. What's up? Don't mind me. I'm just doing my... Oh, look at those love discs. Really funny if those were randomized and they were just like... I don't know, Garchomps or something. I don't know. That'd be funny. Alright. To Topless City. Here I am. Zanyu's dive. Yeah, we dove up. We're diving upwards. All right, here we are. Uh, no, I think we're good now. So here's the gym. I think we want to go left, because definitely want to go left. I know where we're at. I know where we're at right now. So we definitely want to go left, unless this is different from the original, which I doubt it. It'd be funny if they like made you go right instead. Um, that is the center. We don't want to do that. We want to go up here. We'll be. Oh my goodness, it's so bright. Oh wait, do I have to have them take me here? I'm pretty sure I meet them up here, don't I? Yeah, no, there we go. Yeah, I meet him here. I'll say. Indeed. Okay. Yeah, you left me back there, dude. I had to figure out my way when you just flew here. I got laid down, dude. My name is Wallace. I'm this town's gym leader. I've also been entrusted with the protection of the Cave of Origin. This drought is being caused by a power emanating from the Cave of Origin. You have the blue orb, dude. That is the blue orb. Oh, look at that. I see. Follow me. That's right. I got the blue orb. Yeah, you're entrusted with protecting the cave. I literally have the blue orb, and I'm 10. Imagine giving a 10 the blue orb. Cannot be me. People in Pokemon need sunlight to live, so why does the sunlight fill us with so much dread? Shut up. You are so dumb, dude. It's because it's freaking 500 degrees, dude. If it were to happen, yeah, stop talking, bro. Like, dude, why are you talking for when we're trying to save the world? What is up with these people? I got things to do. I got I got lives to save. Oh no, not these fools. Have I already destroyed you once? Team Magma and Team Aqua. We've been waiting, you scamp. Leader Maxi, to that child? I know what, ma what has to be done. I will entrust this to you now. It is the fruit of our collaboration with Devon Corporation and it presents Represents the height of Hoenn's technological knowledge and skill. What'd you just give me? The magma suit. You just gave me a magma suit? You think I'm part of Team Magma now? We had actually been preparing that in anticipation of making contact with Groudon, but at this point it doesn't look like there's any hope for the, of that for us. There's nothing we can do except leave it to you. And yet, even with that magma suit, it's probable that anyone could pass through that magma now. Fiercer than ever due to the forces of nature. This is true. It is very possible that the energy could be far greater than our calculations show. There's nothing to fear. The blue orb he bears, its ancient power will protect both the boy and his Pokemon. You've hit the nail on the head. Those old folks at Mount Pier, 
did say something about that. That the red orb would unleash Groudon's primal powers and trigger a primal reversion, while the blue orb, the power to reverse that and calm the beast. That's right. Oh, calm the beast. Yes, energy overflowing from the Cave of Origin just now. It is the same energy that gives Groudon's powers with the blue orb, which contains the power to suppress that. It should be possible to calm the rage of the of this flood of magma. Of course, the blue orb's power alone will not lead you to where Groudon waits. You will not reach Hoenn's core that way. Use that suit that you were just given with that. It will finally become possible to stand up against the forces of nature. Do you, do you, to think that you had the blue orb, you'll be okay. And you and your Pokemon can handle it. Whatever happens, I believe that. Oh, dude, we got Zane, dude. My, my boy Zane. Zane, I, I mean, he'll take on Groudon 1v1. No scopes only. Trick shot final kill. I mean, on Rust. Modern Warfare 2 Rust. I mean, my Zane will destroy this. This Groudon. All right, I'm tired of talking to you guys now. You guys are all boring old people. I'm 10 and I'm ready to party. Oh my goodness, here comes freaking May. May, are we going to have a rival battle right here? I'm in. Let's have a rival battle just to show these fools. That'd be so funny. Okay, you can stop talking any second now, May. The world is ending. Believe it or not, the world is about to be gone if you keep talking to me about your nonsense. I have to go save the world now. Goodbye. Thank you, everybody. It was a... Jeez, Louise, now there's women here? These two, like... Whammon? Are, are, are you like Celebration Whammon? That's weird, dude. Why are there Celebration Whammon? Unless those are robots to protect. Make sure no one else goes inside the cave. That'd be wild. Alright, let me in. Wait, am I gonna have to have Flash in here? Oh my gosh, there's an encounter in here. These Pokemon have been stuck? The oh no, not a Whooper. Isn't this a thing that can do counter or mirror cut or something? But wait, have these Pokemon been stuck in this cave their whole life? Just starving? Eating each other to live? Oh my goodness. What have you been eating this whole time? Wait, do I go left? Or do I go up? Up seems to be the way to go. I mean, Groudon just get, did get angry. Okay, come on. I have to use a repel, dude. Oh my goodness, that is, uh, that's the, um, uh, Ultra. Oh, that's the Sun and Moon Legendary. What's up, my dude? Or wait, is that considered a Legendary? Because I know you just have to get all the cells to get him. Is he considered a legend? Probably is, right? Let me get a... Um, let me get a, a Max Repel going in here. I don't want to battle any of those. Imagine if I just sit in here and battle those and just trained up while Groudon was ruining the world. Come outside with my Pokemon strong as ever. What was that sound? That... That sounded like a, a familiar Pokemon. I'm hearing all these Pokemon. All right, we're definitely going the right way to the ground. Um, come on, let me go. Let me at him. Let me at him. Here we go. Uh oh, I'm gonna have to put on the magma suit soon. I think. Dude, this is a cool game. They did a good job. They did a good job with this game for sure. I just, I think uh, it would make more sense if you couldn't battle any trainers while the world was ending. But that's just me. Okay. It's getting hotter. I should probably put on the magma, the magma, the the ma the ma the, ma the magma suit. There we go. Here we are, you foul beast. Come here, come at me, bro. Actually, wait. Ugly bug is in the front, not not Zane. Wait, I never got a master ball. I really do have to capture this thing without a master ball. Oh, am I gonna jump in the lava? That'd be sick, dude. Put me in the lava. Where's my master ball? Why didn't no one give me a master ball? No, for real, though. Do I really not have a Master Ball? Dude, what? Am I about to jump in the lava? Dude, don't say I'm about to jump in this lava, dude. What is happening? Ah, he just shows up. Oh, hey, am I going to ride you? Am I going to ride the back of you? Oh, my Papa John's order is on the way. It's coming way early. Where are you, Flags? What the heck? I'm getting a weird DoorDash uh, text message. Let me go ahead and pause this video real quick. Oops. All right. Here we go. We're good? We're back. All right. So my Papa John's delivery was supposed to be here 
like not even close to right now. It's supposed to be here in like 45 minutes and it's here now. So a little wild. And yeah, in the text they said because apparently he's been knocking for a while because I didn't I didn't I have headphones on. My door's closed. I didn't expect him to be here. He said, "Where are you, flag?" Like what does that mean? Where are you, flag? Did he try to call me something different? Not cool. Not cool, but I got I got the pizza. So I'm gonna oh my goodness, I literally am riding on Groudon's back. I thought that was a joke. I'm riding on Groudon's back. Why is he not hitting me off and just throwing me in the lava? Like, is he just cool with this? Oh my goodness, we're about to go into the lava. Oh, I'm 10. Am I sacrificing my life for the greater good of humanity? What is actually happening? No, for real, what's going on? Uh-oh. What is happening? Hello? Dude, this is actually like the coolest thing ever. I thought I played this game. Apparently I never did. Or I just have zero memory of this. But this is the coolest stuff I've ever been a part of in any game. Alright. Right on. You, oh, I have no communications. Can I still, like, look at my stuff? Alright, I can. Alright, we're gonna lead with Margin. We have Thunder Wave, right? Because I know I can do Dragon Breath, but that has a chance. Hey, okay, we have Thunder Wave. We're gonna lead with Margin. So whatever it is, we can paralyze it. Let's do this. Whatever you are. What if it actually, what if it's just a Groudon? And it doesn't get randomized? Who knows? Or what if it gets randomized to Groudon? That's possible. Alright. What's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? Hmm. What's it gonna be? This is alright. This is a. This would be a cool animation if I wasn't highly anticipating what this randomized amount was gonna be. Let's check my nails. What is literally, what is actually happening? This is the crate. He's, he's pr going primal on me. Oh. I wonder why my guy took off the magma suit. I think you would keep the magma suit on when you're literally in just in a pit of lava. And also, how do I get out of here? Let's say I didn't catch this crowd on. I just destroyed it. How do I get out of this lava pit? Because I had to ride the ground on to get into the lava pit. You know what I'm saying? Weird. <laughs> oh, man. A crappy legendary. Are you kidding me? I don't want a shaman. I wanted a Mewtwo. Shaman. Shaman. Hey man, I guess Magic Leaf is sick. I mean, that's a nice move. Never misses, right? But still, dude. Like, come on. Of all the things I could have got, I got a Shaman. Dang it. Well, hopefully, I don't know, like, is this catch rate going to be, like, the same as if I would have done Groudon or whatever? There's going to be an easier catch rate. Red? Perfect. Alright. Paralyzing red. It's Ultra Ball season. Well, so while we're throwing Ultra Balls, uh, I don't have anyone here to talk to, to talk about their day. So how is your guys' day going? How, how, is your mouth watering ever since I told you that I have pizza here? And you might be wondering, did you get pizza here set, oh, nice. Uh, but what I was gonna say before I got rudely interrupted by Shaman is that I did in fact eat one slice of the pizza and I don't care I washed my hands so there's not grease on my controller and that's life that's the life we're living out here now one thing I will say I'm concerned about is there is pizza in my kitchen and Edgar is roaming free in the house now I don't think he'll be a bad enough boy to go towards the pizza but I'm not a hundred percent sure so, I'm going to name him Flag. Do you remember the time that my pizza delivery guy texted me and called me a flag? So, Shaman, you are now called Flag. Oh, got transferred to box one? I wanted him to be in my party. 
Whatever. Another cutscene? Let's go ahead and take a drink, dude. Of our today's not sponsor, G Fuel Hydration. Not sponsored, obviously. Look at my sub count. You think I'm sponsored by G Fuel? No. Maybe one day. Dude, the hydration, though, is awesome. I love the hydration formula. I've always wanted, like, a non-caffeine G Fuel, just because I love the taste of it so much. So, hydration is that plus hydration. It's supposed to be, supposed to, supposed to hydrate you. So, you're getting two birds stoned at once. You're getting, killing two birds with one stone. Something like that. Two things are happening at one time. I'm drinking a good flavor. This is the Phaseberry flavor, hydration. While... Also, not feeling myself with caffeine and staying hydrated. Edgar, hey, no barking. Hey, Edgar, no barking at the people outside. There's kids outside uh, doing chalk on the sidewalk, and I think that's pretty cool. Hey, no bark at the kids. Yeah. Don't bark at the kids. They're just having fun out with the chalk. Edgar, I'm going to close the curtain on your face. Look at this nice cutscene. Hey, look at me. No. You don't. Yeah, Edgar Duffy was not getting in the pizza because he would not be in here right now. He would he would still be eating it. He's a little man. There's a lot of pizza in there. Look at everyone having a good time. Oh, the Team Magma people. They're still frowning. You losers. I just saved your life from the world that you tried to destroy. Look at all the Whalemers. They're so happy I caught the Shaman. They caught a Shaman. Happy Shaman. Team Aqua's even here. Dude, what's up with, like, the horns? Like, this is weird, dude. Weird flex. Weird. So, just cut. We're cut scene in. Now, am I, you might be wondering, am I going to be that loser who goes and gets my legendary to fight the 8th gym leader? Absolutely. Um, do I think that that shouldn't be a thing still? I feel like you should just have to defeat the legendary and not be able to capture it. Capture it? I, I think so. But I don't care. Because it's a shaman. Shaman, I don't even know what game Shaman's from, okay? And I know someone out there is getting mad at me, but I don't. I have no idea. Should I Google it? Let's Google Shaman. Edgar, what have I told you about barking? Uh-oh. Huh. Awkward. Shaman. I really wish that my Google Chrome would not have opened on that screen like it just did. But here we are. Shaman. It is a Gen 4 grass type mythical. It's a mythical. So why did I get a mythical in place of my legendary? I played Gen 4. I played Diamond and Pearl. Why, why did I never see a shaman? Maybe I did see a shaman. I don't know. Okay. Are you guys all going to keep talking forever? Because I'm over this. Are you guys all over this? Making sure on my Google screen. Yeah, there's nothing in here personal that I have to cut out. So we're good. I'm just going to leave that. It's only showed for like literally, what, a second, maybe? Oh uh, boy, you guys are all talking about how you tried to kill the world and I stopped you. A 10 year old saved the day. Idiots. Absolute idiots. Someday we adults are gonna have to hand this world to this little scamp and the rest of his generation. Yeah, make that day today, dude, okay? You go home, put yourself in quarantine for the rest of your life, please. Don't think just because you're Team Aqua, you're in the clear. Because if we were playing. Uh, Alpha Sapphire, you'd be the one in trouble right now. Oh, I got the red orb. Thank you. And that's it for me. Later, scamp. Fail, will. See you later, Maxi. Wait, why is Maxi not going to jail? Maxi, come back here. I'm going to use my shaman and put you in jail. Team Magma and Team Aqua are made up of people with completely opposing ideals and goals, but perhaps even they can learn to meet halfway one small concession at a time. Wow, dude. You are so cool. Uh, let's see here. Can I skip? Can I skip all this? I just want to... I would like to battle the gym leader if that is cool with everyone. The Eon Flute? What does the Eon Flute do? Maybe he was right. The Eon Flute is proof of the bond between you and your Latios. No matter how far you may be from one another, play that flute and Latios will surely fly straight to you. Then it can take to the sky, soaring above the land, and it will stride its way back. Yes, just when we first encountered Latios and Latios on the southern island. What does that mean? Does that mean I can call Latios if I put him in the box? He'll just begin to... What if I had Latios in the box this whole time? Like, would you have still given me that flute? 
And you and your Pokemon live and grow in this changed world. I wonder. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what's crazy, dude? This whole time, our egg's still not hatched. <laughs> we're getting rid of that egg and taking the shaman, dude. This egg, he's had his chance to hatch. All right, mate. Are we going to battle now? I'll fight you. I'll fight you right now, sucker. All right. Stop talking to me. Everyone stop talking. I need to go get the 8th gym badge so I can take on the Elite 4. <laughs> yes, the Elite 4, you see? Yes. <laughs> Alright. I'm glad I got to save the world. Um, No no parade, celebration, no money. That, that's what it'd be like if in today's world someone saved the world like that. It wouldn't be like us, a 10-year-old... Being like, alright, I saved the world, time to go continue my adventure. I'd be like, yo, where's the news? Where's me money? Where's that cash flow? Where are... Where's my TV show? I should be in a TV show now. That's what today's world is, but no, not me. Not humble D. Hello? Hello? Okay, we got the... Oh, the Pokemon Center's on the other side. I'm not even going to waste my time in there. Nothing in there I want. I guess I could use some Hyper Potions, but I don't care. We'll get Hyper Potions after we destroy Wallace. Let's go over here. Everyone get out of my way. I need to go get my Shaman. My Flag. Let's go get Flag. Hello. 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 Let's go get Flag. All right. Flag. There's Lanet's box. Lanet's organize. All right. Shaman. Whoa. Why are you much smaller now? Ability pressure garbage. Item the mental herb. Why are you not in cool form right now? What's up with that? Is this thing even close to hatching? Or does it still say it doesn't seem close to hatching still? Like what is in that thing? Is it, did anyone... This is the squad then, huh? Well, the Shaman, for some reason, just isn't cool for him. I battled it while it was cool for him, but now it's not cool for him anymore. Huh. I don't know. I don't make the rules. What does a mental herb do? Item. Give me that item. Give me that mental herb. I, I want to read what it does. Mental herb... The user, the holder shakes off mood binding effects to move freely. It can only be used once. Oh, okay. That's cool. We'll give it back to you. You can have the mental herb. That's yours now. Does that mean like I can like use once I can just avoid like a confusion or avoid like a paralyze maybe? Does it work when asleep? No one knows. Oh man, that shaman's the first Pokemon I have not in a regular Pokeball. All right, let's put the shaman back in the box. No, I'm kidding. Dude, I like when all my Pokemon are just in regular Pokeballs, but I didn't think that that would be so easy to capture. If I would have known it was going to be a one Ultra Ball capture, I would have thrown a bunch of Pokeballs at it. That was going to be a whole bunch of Ultra Balls to capture it, and I was going to run out of Poke Ultra Balls. Whatever. I guess I did have it paralyzed in the red? What is up with that guy down there? Oh, is this the freaking... Oh, man. Okay, I can do this. I can do this. Whew, okay, I can do this. Oh, wait, this one you have to like actually get off and get back on? Let's just do the same thing here. That, that, that. Okay. And we have to go up. Oh, wait, did I mess up here? Bum, bum, bum. Wait. Um. Whew, that was close. That was close. Okay. Oh, there's trainers here I gotta worry about. So we just do this strat again, right here. Bang, bang, bang. 
Bang 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 and then what? Do we just do these three? Like this? Get over here. Oh crap! Do I have to move her? No, I can do this. Then do I do this? Bang bang. Bang bang. Hmm. And then here. And then crap. Wait. Not that. I should do that. That. Bang bang. Bang bang bang. Bang bang bang. Bang 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 bang. Oh my goodness, that was stressful. Oh, that is the 30 minute mark. Okay, we got through the puzzle. We're gonna end the episode here. That was a stressful maze. I don't know why that was so stressful. It was pretty easy, actually. That's gonna do it for today's episode. Thank you guys for all stopping by. That was stressful. We got a shaman. Let's go look at the shaman one more time to end the episode, shall we? I gotta go eat some pizza, too. You guys probably are hungry now. Thank you guys for stopping by today's episode. Here is shaman. Oh, you can only see him on the small screen, unfortunately. Whatever. Sorry. Uh, thank you guys for all stopping by, and I'll see you guys all later. Goodbye.